jagged resists corrosion well, the steel is reliably protected by high-quality galvanizing. The only exception is the place under the chrome trunk lining, it is there that after a couple of years the paint can swell, but dealers eliminate such bubbles under warranty without question. The paintwork is covered by an extended warranty that is valid for six years from the date of sale to the original purchaser. Like many other cars, the chrome frame of the body does not withstand the activity of chemicals that cover the roads of our country in winter. In just one season, chrome can become cloudy, as a result of which the car noticeably loses its visual appeal, and after all, the image for the owner of a business class sedan is extremely important. To delay this problem, you need to wash the car after each working, dirty, day, and not in a non-contact way, but in the old-fashioned way, with the sponge removing the road cocktail plaque. Otherwise, you will have to change chrome around every year almost every year, and dealers often do not consider this problem to be a warranty issue, billing Jaguar growers for cosmetic repairs in amounts of about hundreds of thousands of rubles. That is why some of the owners were looking for ways that were more gentle for the wallet, for example, they covered the chrome with vinyl or even completely repainted the decor with a more resistant to thinner paint. Of the electric assistance to the owner, broken filaments for heating the front seats can upset. The problem, most likely, lies not in them, but in the control unit, which needs to be replaced. There have been rare complaints about glitches, a blind spot and light sensors, as well as spontaneous discharge of the battery. Transmission. All XF officially sold in Russia were equipped with the only possible 6-speed ZF gearbox, unit model, 6HP26. The automatic transmission does not cause any particular complaints, although some owners complain that the box selector in the form of a sort of metal washer can spontaneously jam. Sometimes it was enough to simply remove the mass from the battery to solve the problem, but if this procedure does not help, then the selector may need to be replaced. Sometimes the onboard diagnostic system displays the message, gearbox fault, while increasing the crankshaft speed does not affect the dynamics in any way. In some cases, restarting the ignition system can help, and the reason lies either in the current automatic transmission cooling line, tubes, or in the unit cooling radiator clogged with dirt, especially after the winter season. If you quickly eliminate these shortcomings, or a complete cleaning of the radiator cells, you need to dismantle the front bumper then you can do without repair or replacement of an expensive machine. So before buying it is extremely important not only to listen to the operation of the automatic transmission, but also to examine it on the left. The owners are also annoyed by the rear gearbox. Quite often, oil begins to ooze through the oil seals of the drives and the shank even at short runs. If you do not replenish its reserves in time, then running dry quickly leads to failure of the final drive. So this unit must also be carefully examined before purchase. Otherwise, you can get at least a quarter of a million rubles, about how much a new gearbox and work to replace it at official dealers will cost. In addition, be sure to look into the service book. If the previous owner carefully fulfilled his obligations to undergo maintenance at dealers, then even in the post-warranty period, the subsequent buyer has the right to count on Goodwill, a kind of analog of the more famous among BAG brands, Galantz. Then the representative office of the brand will take on most of the costs, compensating them to the dealer. However, not so long ago, some unofficial cat service stations have a service to eliminate such a scourge. For 40 to 50,000 rubles, they will restore the note to you and give it a six-month warranty. Engines In the secondary market, the most common engine in the XF is a naturally aspirated 238 horsepower B6, factory index AJ6WG. This engine was not only the most affordable, but also assumed a moderate transport tax, all other modifications overcame the 250 horsepower barrier. With. It is impossible to say that this engine turned out to be capricious. The 6 calmly endures runs of 200 or more thousand kilometers. A chain is working in the timing gear drive, the condition of which must be monitored every 100,000 kilometers and, if necessary, replaced as an assembly with the tension roller. The weak point of this engine, perhaps, should be recognized as its appetite. On an empty highway with a working cruise control, the sedan is content with 9 to 10 liters, but in the city the onboard computer draws much less pleasant numbers, 20 to 24 L slash 100 kilometers. True, sure, is justified by the reliability of the 6, so we are ready to recognize it as the best choice for the XF. Oddly enough, with dynamic driving, more powerful versions with 5-liter V8S may turn out to be even more modest in consumption, 
but in the city they will certainly take their 25 liters per hundred. These motors are very reliable. True, it is almost impossible to find a 375 strong copy on the secondary market, and a modification with the compressor, 510 horsepower, often attracted the interest of racers who are not averse to annealing at traffic lights, so buying such a car requires a particularly thorough check of both the power unit itself and, possibly, the tortured gearbox. An alternative to gasoline-hungry engines is a fairly reliable twin-turbo diesel. Unfortunately, only the most powerful version with a capacity of 275 forces was officially delivered to our country, which implies the highest possible tax rate. This affected the preferences of buyers. It is very difficult to find a diesel Jag with mileage, European modifications, 211 and 240 horsepower, are not at all represented on the market. Quite often, with a run of 25,000 to 40,000 kilometers, the onboard computer version 3.0 TD is able to upset the owners with the message, restricted performance, power limit mode, which can be interpreted as a sign of the death of the turbocharger. In fact, the most likely culprit is a soot clogged DPF particulate filter. He knows how to clean himself, so the problem, it would seem, should be solved by itself. And yet, High sulfur domestic diesel fuel requires increased attention to the replaceable element, accelerating its unscheduled replacement. So if on the display you see the inscription, DPF full, on a red background, you will have to part with at least 100,000 rubles, an expensive replacement procedure, even for new cars, as a rule, is not covered by the warranty. Service station employees referred to the fact that the filter had become unusable due to low quality fuel. Chassis and steering. A fairly common reason for the first owners to contact the dealer was knocks in the suspension, as a rule, when driving through various kinds of bumps. The reason may lie in the solid blocks of the front upper or rear lower arms. The XF suspension is almost identical to the S-Type's predecessor, and is therefore well known to mechanics. Keeping it in good health is not difficult, although the high cost of spare parts cannot be ignored. Sometimes, with a run of 50 to 70,000 kilometers, the front wheel bearings can fail. This part comes complete with the hub and will cost the owner at the dealer about 20,000 rubles, plus about 5,000 for work. Quite often, already with a run of 20 to 30,000 kilometers, the steering rack may fail. In this case, you will feel noticeable knocks at large steering wheel angles. Replacing it outside the warranty means spending 120,000 rubles. Do not forget that the manufacturer recommends replacing brake hoses every five years, regardless of mileage. If the working fluid has time to gain moisture, then they can become cracked from overheating in three years. So, we found out that it is possible to buy XF on the secondary market, despite the prevailing stereotype. It is most reasonable to stop at a 3-liter gasoline, 6, all the more so since potential buyers of new sedans are already deprived of such an opportunity. Now the role of the base engine is a 2-liter gasoline, or turbocharged from the Ford Mondeo. At the same time, even the simplest XF has an impressive list of equipment, which is quite consistent with the noble business sedan from the premium segment.